Rand's really superstars women made a stunning comeback from 4-1 down to defeat Flo Foji Ken Rockets women on penalties in the semifinals of the Elvis Star Brown Women's League on Thursday at the Warner Park. Keon took a 4-1 lead in the first half with Shakola Wilson scoring a five-minute hat-trick late in the first half to give the Green Valley girls a commanding position going into halftime. But then the heroics of national player Caroline Springer saw Village restoring parity in the second half in less than 10 minutes. The match was broadcast live on the SKNFA website. Commentators Al Edwards and LaShawn Dixon. Central, Springer, Springer's getting fouled. Springer must get off the bus. Springer gets there. Springer scores. She's almost taking off her jersey, but Springer is celebrating a big one. She's lost. She's gone. Yes, um, finally some, some, some uh, goal mode action. Kian losing the ball in the pass. Ryan Village Superstars breaking on them. Springer, experienced footballer in her own right. Simmons goes across the goal mode. And the far point is just on here. Equalizing for Kayon. 1 1. Great ball across. They're happy. They're very happy. Even the keeper <laughs> winning 100 yards to get one. Good football. Yes, yes, yes. Kayon hit back. So, is that Maynard coming on for Kayon? Clark gets it. Clark loops it over to, to the goal. The keeper comes out, loses it. Kayon scores again. Drops the ball. The, line, the referee is running. Trying to consult with her linesman. The linesman didn't have a flag up. She's walking towards the, the, the center line. And so it looks as if the goal would stand. Parliamentary yes. discussion between referee and lines person. And that gives it to Jasonia. Jasonia trying to free Wilson. Wilson is free. Asking for offside. Wilson breaks. Wilson gets to the box. Wilson scores. Number three to Kian. They're celebrating. The village players stood up looking one outside. It wasn't there. Yes, I am. I, at first, I initial, my initial thought is that it was, it was outside, but the referee flag stayed down. The ref trying to kick it through. Trying to find Jasonia. Jasonia has two players with her. Jasonia kicks. Leibold comes forward. Kick the main hat is there. A number of players trying to convert on the ball. Kayan gets it. Shoots a goal. Over on the head of Leibold. Goal again. Goal Wilson. again. A hat second? trick. A hat trick for Wilson. <laughs> she yes. can't be found. Is that Wilson? Yes, a hat trick. A hat trick for Shikola Wilson in about five minutes. A five minute hat trick. Um, if I can recall, she scored the first one in the 39th. The 42nd and now the 45th minute. She sticks a boat in. Could be dangerous. The ball comes in now. Reese through the legs of Reese. And into the back of the net. Four goals to two. Yes, the goalkeeper, like she picked up that, that, that ball late. She, she was unaware that it was coming straight to her and it landed and it skidded and went between her legs, it looked like, from my vantage point. Goes into Springer, Springer trying to turn the player. Springer blocked partially, headed to Reese. Reese knocks it accidentally. Then Springer is in. Springer sends it in. No, that's that Springer. Four goals to three. <laughs> well, uh, that's Pacey Francis. Yes, the party is definitely a different. Nightmare for goalkeepers tonight. Yes, um. <laughs> no, she gives it. Oh, Springer gets it this time. No, Springer goes to the right. Springer shoots. As in the back of the net, an equalizer. An equalizer. <laughs> yes. Believe it or not, it's 4 4. 4 4. And we haven't played 10 minutes as yet. Ivanka. Shot and goal outside. So, Village, Village takes it. Village celebrates. And for defeating. On in the semi final, they go forward to play Newtown. After the match, coach Fabian Clark of Village Superstars said the way the girls performed in the first half was not characteristic of his team, and they promised him a better performance in the second half. Uh, I didn't expect that from the girls, and I expected a better um, first half um, due to how we played, played them last time. You know, I was really expecting them to play much better tonight, but it showed that the character of the girls, them that they're strong and they're determined. And they really tell me, coach, just relax, we got you, and we're going to win for you, and they did it for me. Yeah, so, kudos to them, I'm thankful. As for Keon's coach, Tyrone O'Loughlin, giving away a commanding lead to lose on penalties is a devastating way to end the season. Definitely, it's a hard, it's a hard last first, because as I said, it was a 4 1 first half, and we went in um, the second half, well, the game plan, they played totally different from the game plan, where we said, at halftime and we made a mistake all in the second half and from that team just went flat tried to shout at them to think by like they get all that the mistake had them out. village will meet newtown women in the finals on sunday 
at the Warner Park at 7pm.